536. Fright Night's also not recommended for meteorologists. No, this this cable, in case you're wondering, is my pacemaker. So, yeah, I don't <laughs> think I'll be, uh, it's not a microphone, it's a pacemaker. That yeah, was I'll scary enough for nights. me. I, I'm a little bit uh, weak of heart for that kind of stuff, absolutely. Uh, yeah, if for the faint of heart, as far as the weather goes, we've got some stormy conditions rolling in for this Thanksgiving weekend and getting here momentarily. Now, this weather report brought to you by the Sports Celebrities Festival. And we're starting out with clouds closing in, the rain right on the doorstep. So, definitely developing for the morning hours. There was some fog on the way in early on. That gets shoved aside, courtesy of the wetter weather. And yes, it's going to get windier and wetter into the afternoon. But right now, Port Moody reporting overcast skies. 14 degrees. Look at how mild it is. That is the tropical air moving into place right now from this huge, uh, what was a hurricane offshore, now a post tropical storm Oho. 13 degrees in Surrey under the clouds currently. And we've got temperature as well into the teens all around the district. 13 in White Rock as well. Here's the big scale satellite shot showing you what's going on. So this system rolling up the west coast of Haida Gwaii right now. We don't put this icon on a BC weather map very often, but that is a post tropical storm. That is what is left of Oho. It's just loaded with energy. It's moving up into the Gulf of Alaska. And as it does so, it completely impacts the other systems that are developing there right now and coming down to our part of the world for this weekend. So we'll get some rain. We'll get some wind this afternoon. I'm not even calling it that stormy today. Just a wet and windy day, 18. Tomorrow's weather will be worse. There's some heavier rain embedded in there, some stronger winds, 16 degrees. Now, I think we get a break in the action. We're drying out Sunday's forecast. Yes, a, a break or two of sun, not another question, a bit of a breather. Sunday night and Monday, more downpour. So for the afternoon on Thanksgiving Day, improving. And that looks like the start of a, uh, something big, I suppose, because it dries up and clears up for several days, probably every single afternoon next week. And the temperatures, they're elevated into the upper teens. Happy Friday morning to you, Thor. You too. I noticed it was a little warmer.